contractless. Our wandering led us to aiding a local patrol against Noxahar. Split between zombie and beast, these wild creatures ate the dead in order to evolve into increasingly higher forms. There was no reason to risk ourselves when the very competent and well-armed militia was already involved. We held for an opportunity to ride in like the cavalry and steal the glory. The locals would love us for our boldness, while we remained unexposed to the dangers of a forward charge. Immediately after, we found ourselves on the heels of a weakened brigand group. Unwilling to engage in the questionable grounds of either a forest or a swamp, the taxpayer battalion stuck to them until open plains and leapt at the chance for money and glory. A fairly defense-oriented squad, good helms, medium armor, shields, and numbers, we would need to take care to prevent the enemy from turning the terrain against us, like hitting on our flanks and forcing us to fight uphill. For once, we would detach from standard openings and take a risk, forming a shield wall on the hill. Once the enemy was engaged, our wing flankers could surround them and we could play to our greatest strength. Clean up operations. They finally caught up to us and made the mistake of spreading out. Brigands were too overeager for treasure and lacked solid tactics and discipline. As we flooded out and around them, they were left with no recourse but death. One of our men, injured, suffered a mighty blow and fell amongst the dead of the field.
Even as we rolled over the enemy, defending hard against them in man-to-man, -man, while the bulk of the squadron systematically singled out and crushed the resistance, our morale was flagging. Our resolve was crucially low. We were in need of a strong leader like a monk bannerman sergeant. It would be time soon to rally the funds to gain such an experienced warrior to fight among our ranks and bolster the spirit. Though Otwin lay dead on the field of honor, many were bulwarked into a new understanding of the combat arts, and the weapons stripped from the dead would raise new crowns for Otwin's replacement. In the halls of the Citadel of Oddfest, we gained yet tougher and thicker armor across the board. You know, I actually used to hold the purchase of several mercenary companies for defense of my lands. Interestingly, there was a mercenary general I had to execute once, when he threatened to kill all the nobles of my homeland. A true fool he was, and my rat sorcerer showed her treasonous colors by trying to back him. My companion burned me with magical flame to keep me from killing this commander, the Raven and then had the gall to argue philosophy with me afterwards. Some people, you know, know respect for the nobility. The gods made us better and placed us over commoners as their representative on the ground. And I feel like there should be more recognition of that. Just a little, what do you call it here on Earth? Backstory lore drop? Leberek the Wise grabs a chest off his shelf and puts it on the desk. When he opens it, a bevy of papers pop out, almost scurrying to get free. He grabs one and lays it out. On one side, there's a contract, and the other, a small drawing of a map. It's a real simple, Cecil. I have been uh, contracted to deliver some particular cargo to Wiedeberg. I have the goods, but I don't have the guards. If you're interested in being carving guards for a time, maybe two days or so, let me know and we can uh, hash out some numbers. Excellent. A well-deserved rest, a milk run to pay the bills and add a little cash, and at a critical time when our food resources are so low. Almost divine intervention, even. Coin and roads for the champion of a god. Reaching Weideberg, Caravan leader turns to you, a large satchel in hand. Thanks for getting us here, sellsword. You take it, and hand it over to Carl the Braggart for counting. He nods when he's finished. The caravan leader smiles. Also, thanks for not betraying us and, you know, slaughtering us to a man and all that. Mercenaries get thanked in the strangest ways. You gain 580 crowns. Weideberg is now well supplied. Crowns well deserved. Till of Talbak welcomes you, and a few of his men hurry over to take the cargo. He claps you on the shoulder. I take it your journey went well. You spare him the details and inquire about your pay. Ha! That's a sword through and through. Ingolf, get this man what he deserves! One of Till of Talbak's bodyguards walks over and hands you a small chest of crown. You gain 1,330 crowns. Crowns well deserved. Accepting job after job hauling long-range contracts, we were putting ourselves in a position to end up with spare cash for more men. Deciding that Eichenberg is a good place to invest your efforts, you decided to offer the protection of the company and take up any work suitable to your talents. You act like a gentleman in your dealings with the locals and encourage the men to mind their manners while in the settlement. There was, of course, some griping at first. Norman the Black was sorely disappointed to give up brawling with the farmers, 
especially with the taxpayer battalion spending so much time in Eichenberg. But you convinced the man that having a friendly base of operations is important in your line of work, as it meant getting better prices on the market and more people willing to join your motley band. It's also much less tiring not having to dodge the militia all the time. You even enlisted the men to do some small tasks in exchange for nothing but goodwill. Or found a little brat who wandered off and dragged him right home. Here the crags, quickly outvied by Leonhardt. I went to the market for the spinster, split a firewood for winter, and even put out a washing. But I draw the line at rescuing the treed cats. This will help us. Traveling far afield from Hagamus, the men balk and gamble and beat upon each other. Their surly nature was not soothed by the occasional drink, and discipline would need to be enforced. Once we reached our destination, retraining was in order. I am, as always, your Count, Ronald Swan, and see you soon. <laughs>